First at four o'clock, three teenagers died in our region this past weekend in off road crashes. First in Spartanburg County, authorities say a UTV veered off the road and overturned in Chesney, killing a teenager. Troopers say it was traveling north on Hardin Road around 1230 yesterday morning. We're told three people were on the UTV at the time. Officials say one of the passengers was flown to the hospital. The coroner said he died this morning and has been identified as 16 year old Ethan Harrell. Spartanburg School District 2 confirms that he was a student at Boiling Springs High School. Now, a Spartanburg County man has been denied bond after the solicitor says he was drunk while behind the wheel of that vehicle in Chesney. This is a story you will only see here on WYFF News 4. Our Ray Arena was in the courtroom this afternoon and joins us live with more details. Ray. Randall Bell was crying, audibly sobbing, as he heard the solicitor describe the details of a crash that killed 16-year-old Ethan Harrell. Bell appeared wearing an orange jumpsuit as he walked into his arraignment this afternoon. He has been charged with felony DUI resulting in death after an early morning Sunday Monday crash uh, near the intersection of Hardin Road and Henry Cash Road. Spartanburg School District 2 confirms Harold was a student at Boiling Springs High School. Officials say he played first base and was a pitcher on the school's baseball team. The coroner says a 16 year old died this morning at Spartanburg Regional Medical Center. His aunt was in the courtroom today and spoke before the judge denied Bell's bond. We won't ever get to see his pictures, of his fishing trips or, or his hunting trips again because of an adult that should have been there to take care of him. The solicitor says Bell admitted to drinking throughout the day before the crash happened. He went on to say Bell drank as many as six beers and there was an empty beer found in the side by side. Now, if convicted, Bell faces a maximum prison time of 25 years. His next scheduled court date is October 24th. Reporting live in Spartanburg County, Ray Reyna, WIFF News 4.